thumbnail. I can't close this eye. Oh, I cannot close that eye. My face feels so stiff. Oh, that was a struggle. Okay, hi. It's Thursday. It's 7.30. And um, I'm supposed to have this video up today. So like, not doing the best. I missed the Call Me Tessie Tuesday, my bad. Oh my God, take me off the TikTok. Like somebody take my TikTok away. Cause I'm like, all I, I just, that's the thing like, let me stop. I missed the Call Me Tessie Tuesday. So that means that you're gonna get another video this Saturday. If you hear my dog, he's rude. You already know that. And if you hit the TV, I'm sorry. Like, I'm in my bathroom. My mom's watching TV. She's just rude. She's so freaking rude. Anyways, hello, my name is Tessiah, but you can call me Tazzy. Put your head on my shoulder. Okay, hi. How's the lighting in here? Like bathroom lighting is kind of sucky, but like I bought a ring light from Amazon for like $20. So hopefully it's doing me some justice. I'm here to do um, a skincare routine, but if you're OG, triple OG, OG, triple, triple OG, you know that I did this thing, dang, was it a year ago? It was almost a year ago where I did this um, video testing Sky Jackson skincare routine. And we all know a whole bunch of people were obsessed with their skin because it literally looks like she has perfect skin. So we all want her to drop that skincare routine. So I still have products that I used in that video. And I actually used that as part of my skincare routine. So um, I decided to film one for y'all. This is my skincare routine. First thing we're gonna start off with is um, gummies. These are the Nature's Bounty Hair, Skin, and Nails gummies. If they have pills, I literally cannot swallow pills for my life, so I'm glad they have gummies, so. I'm trying to go longer hair, better skin, and healthier nails. Mom, please! I think we're gonna do the scrub, and then we're gonna do the mask, and then we're gonna moisturize. That's what we're gonna do. So, first things first, I'm gonna wash my face with warm water, because warm water opens up the pores. So let's do that. My mirror's right here, so like... Now, we're gonna do the scrub first, and then we're going to do the mask. Should we do that? Yes. So I'm just gonna scrub it all over my face. I look crazy, so I'm gonna wash this off now. Okay, now that I'm done with the scrub and washing it off, I'm gonna go make the charcoal mask and I'll be right back. Okay, so real quick for anybody who doesn't know how to make a charcoal face mask, you take glue, which sounds weird. Like this, this whole thing is gonna sound weird, but you take glue. We got this a while ago, but this is the activated charcoal powder. We bought this on Amazon. Me and my mom bought this on Amazon a minute ago. I start pouring the powder. And then I mix it with the glue until it's at the right consistency. It looks like this. Kind of shiny now. I only like to put it on this section of my face, so basically the middle. Because my nose has the most black heads, so 
this charcoal face mask is good for that at pulling it out you know once it dries and you peel it off now we're gonna wash this off and start applying the other mask so we're gonna start applying this face mask to the top and bottom part of my face I can already feel my face getting stiff, so. Okay, I'm gonna let this dry for the next like 20 minutes or whatever. I'm just gonna let it dry and I'll be back, okay? Well, I'm back. And both face masks are dry, so now it's time to peel. That is so satisfying to me. Like, please tell me I'm not the only one who thinks peel off face masks are so satisfying. Like, I really, I know I'm not the only one. I know I'm not crazy. Okay, now that most of the other face mask is off, it's time to do the charcoal, which scares me because like, it hurts sometimes. It hurts because it's glowing your freaking face. Of course it's gonna hurt. wash my face with cold water this time to close up my pores and while I do that I'm going to put this baby in the freezer so I can get cold if you don't know what it is it's the beauty bio rose quartz like face and body roller I spent $60 on this. Okay, so that's gonna sit in the freezer while I wash my face off and moisturize. Okay, I don't know who I heard this from, but I'm gonna get my Cetaphil Cetaphil Moisturizer and I'm going to moisturize my face while it's wet. Somebody said it's good to Put your moisturizer on while your face is wet because it locks in the moisture. So, I've been doing that for like the past week. My skin feels so soft right now. So now we're just gonna start rolling. And if you don't know what a rose quartz roller is, it's basically kind of like a contour type situation going on. Look it up, it's good. And it's also good to use while it's cold. That's why I put it in the fridge. I literally sit here and I do this for five minutes, so. Okay, so I did one side of my face so y'all can try and see a difference. And this side, you know, kind of looks more contoured. I do have a chubby face, which I hate, but this side is a little bit more contoured compared to this one that just kind of looks chubby. I don't know if it's an illusion, but I can definitely tell the difference between this and this. Chubby and puffy, chiseled and contoured. Okay, we're finally at the last step of my skincare routine and what I'm gonna do is get my hands damp again and put my moisturizer. So lock back in that moisture, make sure my face isn't dry because you know it's winter season and um it's dry out here in these streets. My hands are dry, now I'm just gonna massage it into my face to dry it out and you know let it sink so i brush my eyebrows up and i put vaseline on my lips to make them look all moisturized and stuff and i can feel refreshed 
Vaseline and literally put it all around. Vaseline is good for you. Okay, I'm done. Okay. The, the lighting difference. I hate myself. Why didn't I do this before? I want to refilm the whole video like this. Can I do that? I'm not going to. That kind of makes me mad because I like this lighting better. So sorry that was like such. So sorry that was such a rush video, but I really hope you enjoyed it. If you have any suggestions for like the product products that you think I should use, you know, let me know in the comments down below. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like it, comment down below whatever you want, and subscribe for more of me and my videos. Coming back strong and better than ever. I need to stop. Okay, bye. Love you.